nicer than you. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm honest. No, we don't need anyone there. All right, 7 p.m. We're going to call the meeting of the Finance Committee to order. Uh, could the clerk please call the roll? Alderman Moran? Present. Alderwoman Timmons? Here. Alderman Clemens? Here. Alderman Gavea? Here. Alderman Camo is here. Alderman Klee? Here. And Mayor Donches? Here. Uh, public comment. Is there any member of the public who would like to address the committee? I don't see anyone. Communications. First from Amy Gerard, Purchasing Manager, Alderman Camo. Yes, thank you. I'd like to make a motion to approve the renewal of the annual Mimecast software maintenance agreement for email spam filtering and archiving through new era technology in the amount of $42,500. Funding will be through Department 122, Information Technology, Fund 54407, Software Maintenance slash General Fund. And Mr. Maisevich is here. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. Nick Maisevich, Chief Information Officer for the City of Nashua. Uh, as you know, my, we use Mimecast for our email uh, filtering and as well as archiving this product we've been using for the past two years now rather successfully and this renewal will enable us to use it for the next coming year. Questions? Discussion? Sorry. Alderman Moran. <laughs> um, how do we stop getting those emails about um, who the right person is to buy PPE? Does, will this filter that out or do I have to keep sending it to spam? I uh, just keep sending it in and we, we block them when we see patterns. We, we don't block individuals. It's when we see a group of things. So it's, definitely we'll don't forward it to you. You're not in charge of buying PPE. Send it to uh, <laughs> Mail Marshal. All right, thank you. You're welcome. Anyone else? All those in favor of the motion say aye. 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 Opposed? Motion passes. All right, the next item is uh, regarding the purchase of vehicles for environmental health. Now, I would like to suggest, and I <laughs> emphasize the word suggest, uh, that we table this to enable us to come forward with a possible alternate proposal regarding electric vehicles, which we would be able to bring back next time. Alderwoman Klee. Uh, thank you. Um uh, Mr. Mayor, yes, I, I will make a motion to uh, table. Or do we have to actually bring the motion forward and then just table it? Or I don't think so. Okay. No. I, I'd I, like to table. But if anyone wants to discuss it before, that's a non-debatable motion. Yes. Does anyone want to say anything? Well, I, I think is a table, okay. is t well, table we'll make, is table, a we'll make tabling a debatable table. motion. How about that? Yeah. So, Alderman Clemens. Thank you. My, my question is only this. If we table this this evening, will we lose the opportunity to buy the vehicles from London Dairy Ford? We might. I think that's not clear, but that's not clear. But there's no guarantee. There's no, you know, uh, no one's saying that they wouldn't sell it to us at the same price in two weeks. So. But we can't, I mean, there's no guarantee that we, we get the same price, I don't believe. What do you think, uh, Ms. Gerard? Maybe, maybe uh, Amy Ms. Gerard. Gerard, purchasing manager. I did speak with Ford of London Dairy, and um, uh, they are willing to hold it for two more weeks. Um, they have had the vehicles on the lot reserved for us. Um, since this bid was due in the beginning of March. Okay. Alderman Clemens. Thank you. Okay, so if we can, if, if, if by the next time we meet for finance, if, if these are still available, just so that they're still on the table for us to decide, I think that would be, I, I feel comfortable with tabling. Alderwoman Clee. Uh, thank you, Mr. Mayor. Before I, I make that official, I do want to make a comment that we did put through a resolution that stated that we would have... Um, if, if at all possible, we would have an analysis as to how the benefits of buying one over the other 
the front end cost versus the back end cost of it. So um, this will give them that time to mm -hmm. do that. And I, I think in keeping with the, the resolution, I think we should table this for a variety of reasons. But I think that being the, the most important. And I, and I have heard from other aldermen that would like to see this kind of paused until we get. Alderman Kamal. Yes, thank you, Mr. Chair. Um, so just so I understand correctly, the existing uh, bid is for gas vehicles and we want to hold off to see if it's possible to purchase electric vehicles. Is that correct? Correct. And this is for the Department of Environmental Health? Correct. So I would think that maybe electric vehicles, given that it's for the Department of <coughs> Environmental Health, might make sense. So I'd be on board with tabling it just to at least do the due diligence to get, to get the comparison. Anyone else? Motion. Alderman Moran. <coughs> oh. I no, please. I, oh, I'd here. like to make a motion to table. Oh, oh okay. that's, that's what I'm going to do. Yeah. <laughs> that's what I was trying to do. <laughs> I already wrote. All well, there's already a motion in there. I, I've got. I've got I, don't know I thought you had something to say about because this. Because you had. No, no. He thought you raised your hand. I agreed. I was agreeable to this since the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I, I have made the motion to table. All right. Anyone else? All those in favor of the motion, say aye. 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 Opposed. Motion passes. And that item is tabled till the, the issue of vehicles for the Environmental Health Department is tabled till the next meeting. Uh, unfinished business, none. Tabled in committee, nothing. New business resolutions or ordinances, neither. Record of expenditures, Alderman Kamau. Yes, thank you, Mr. Mayor. I'd like to make a motion that the Finance Committee has complied with the City Charter and ordinances pertaining to the record of expenditures for the period from March 31st, 2023 to April 13th, 2023. Discussion? All those in favor of the motion say aye. 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 Opposed? Motion passes. Uh, general discussion. Any general discussion? Uh, Alderwoman Timmons. Thank you, Mia. I want to thank IT for finally fixing my um, email. It, I sent my first email out today after a year and a half, and it did not bounce back. Well, so glad, thank you, IT. Glad thank to hear you, that. Thank you, Nick. Anyone else? Remarks or a general discussion? This is public comment. Any member of the public wish to address the committee? No one is here. Remarks by Alderman. Any remarks by Alderman? Alderman Moran. I just have one thing. Uh, I won't be here next week for the Board of Aldermen meeting, but there'll be uh, legislation coming from uh, the fire department regarding um, uh, some new equipment that they want to buy. They want to get uh, the, they want to speed this process up so they don't get stuck with uh, a new generation of um, product that uh, is untested and it could, could be costly uh, with these new EPA standards for this particular um, um, apparatus. Uh, so I just want to express my uh, support of that. I, I believe I sponsored legislation, and, but in the meantime, anyone should reach out to Chief Buxton just to get an overview of what's coming uh, next week. And um, it'll be back in front of finance too, because at some point we'll have to contract with it. But uh, he has um, uh, a good explanation for why we need to do it so quickly, and I hope everyone can support that next week. Now, what, he, um, what the chief is going to make clear at the public hearing, which is a week from Monday, um, is that the supply, the supplier of these vehicles is quickly um, being inundated with orders, and the number of available vehicles is going down quickly. Uh, to the point where even if it's authorized on Tuesday night, which would be a week from Tuesday, you know, there's no guarantee they'll be able to get these vehicles, but, um, or at least without a, a different motor, without a different motor. But, so his hope is that I would go ahead, if assuming the purchase is authorized by the alderman, that I would go ahead and execute a per, an emergency purchasing order to execute the purchase on Wednesday morning without coming back to finance so that we could just go ahead and get the vehicle before they're sold out. So that's, that's um, you know, that w that's my intention, but I wanted to let you know that that, you know, that could come back to finance in that form. But he's gonna, t he's gonna explain that at the public hearing. That's what he's asking for. So, 
I just want to express the comments since I won't be able to support them next week. And it's, it could be a couple hundred thousand dollars, 100, 200,000 saved if we can you know, do it quickly. All right, any other discussion, any other remarks by Alderman? Uh, Alderwoman Klee. Uh, thank you, Mr. Mayor. At this time, I'd like to motion to adjourn. All those in favor of the motion say aye. 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 Opposed? Motion passes, and the meeting is adjourned at 7.10 p.m. <laughs>